Hi everyone, uh, welcome to the second video of uh, me being open and discussing about making comics. Um, I'm pretty much doing this, uh, I'm putting it into practice. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm making a comic um, <laughs> as for examples for this series. Uh, so the la first video was about the log line um, and I pitched it to you all, um, got some feedback. Uh, thankfully it wasn't a big deal. All I had to do was like snip off a little bit at the end. Um, I didn't have to cha change anything else. But uh, today is also going to be about the log line. Uh, it's log line part two. And then after that we're going to move on to another story device. Uh, we're going to talk about the story spine. Uh, so let's just hop into this one. Um, so for the log line, uh, before, uh, this is all coming from Save the Cat, uh, by Blake Schneider, Blake Schneider, uh, great book. Um, I've read several books on writing so far. I'm really enjoying this one. He's just bringing a lot of structure into my crazy brain, uh, and he's just helping me uh, get through uh, all these steps quickly. So, um, notes down here. Now. The first video, just to recap, the log line is a one sentence, uh, what is it, uh, and about, like, what is your story? Okay, so a log line should have four things. It should have irony. Uh, it should have the audience in mind and the cost, uh, a killer title, and, and a compelling mental image. Uh, so... My, okay, blah, 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 jumping around. Um, so for this, uh, part two for log line, there's, we're going to add um, three more things to the log line, uh, giving a, uh, an adjective for the hero, uh, introducing a bad guy and giving them an adjective, and also um, giving a goal, uh, a basic primal goal, uh, that the hero uh, must overcome. So, let's see if I can remember this on top of my head. Uh, my, because I, I, I think I've lost it. I've like deleted it and like edited my log line. So, I'm trying to remember my earlier log line was um, a teenage girl who wanted to go on adventures and join a misfit crew of, uh, um, of, oh yeah. Okay, so I'm going to talk about my previous log line. Um, see if I can remember it because I haven't, um, I, I kind of like deleted it and lost it. But uh, it was a pretty much a dumbed down version of um, what my log line is right now. Uh, so the previous uh, log line, it was about, um, a straight-laced girl who joined, who uh, wanted to go on adventures um, and uh, found found like her way like joining a misfit crew of flunkies. Um, it's something like that. It's it's bad. <laughs> well, it's it's because it, I'm trying to remember it on top of my head. Uh, now, uh, at least I already have like an adjective, uh, you know, from my hero, but, so my new log line, I'm going to have to read it down here, sorry, <laughs> I did this the first video, I'm doing this again, uh, a straight-laced teenage girl who puts her dreams of Airship Academy on hold to save her rogue brother from aggressive debt collectors by joining a misfit crew of flunkies who specialize in paranormal, jo paranormal jobs. Okay. Um, so there's a few things that I've introduced, um, and like the, the three things, uh, to, um, you know, elevate the log line. Uh, I'm, from the beginning, I already had like an adjective with my, uh, hero, um, you know, a straight laced person, straight laced person, uh, just because it helped, uh, me go ahead and set up irony because she has to go on an adventure with, um, you know, um, flunkies and um, just misfits. 
uh, people that she's not used to like, that people that she just naturally avoids. Now, uh, an introduced, uh, you know, bad guys, um, which is which are the aggressive debt collectors. So bad guys with an adjective. Um, so aggressive debt collectors and um, and the primal goal. Uh, Blake Snyder just really recommends being super basic about this. Um, you know, he says like survival, hunger, sex, protection of loved ones, and fear of death. Um, you know, the, all those grip the audience and will drag us through the story. Um, you know, like just like on a hook. Um, so this one is more the protection of a loved one for sure, because um, she needs to save her brother, and it needs to be something basic and super strong that um, the character will do um, anything to uh, you know get through um, and make sure to achieve their goal. Now, so that's it for this video. Uh, just how to amp that log line, and again. Adjective, uh, give an adjective to the hero, introduce a bad guy, give them an adjective um, as well, and figure out a primal um, goal that's basic and, you know, any, any, it's, and universal. Uh, again, the next video I'm going to talk about another story developing device called the Story Spine, I think. That may, I have to do a little bit more research. Um, but... Uh, it's another great way to quickly lay out story. Um, and I'm going to talk through how I'm going to be using it. Um, if I do go back, I need to go back and re-edit it um, now that I have like adjusted lock my log line a little bit. Um, need to go look at the story. Um, so yes, please, if you have comments on my story, um, I want this to be an open process. If you have questions as I'm going through this, um, I mean, right now we're at the very beginning. Um, but you know, it's, this is layering a cake, man and woman, <laughs> this is layering a cake. Uh, so it's, it's pretty basic, but you're going to start seeing it. it's going to get pretty complex pretty fast. And, um, so yeah, if any questions, comments go below. Also, if you have your own stories, like if you have your own log lines, like, you know, share those, go ahead and pitch them. Uh, I am of the mentality now to um, to start pitching ideas early and often, um, just because I'm getting quick feedback and allows me to make quick adjustments early on that will save me actually more time uh, in the future. Please subscribe to my channel and also subscri subscribe to my email. Uh, you can find a link to my email on my homepage, but also if you go to robinholstein.org um, and go to the gallery page, I put, uh, a, a, like, you can just sign up to my email um, list or my email, like, newsletter there. Uh, once a month, I uh, release a newsletter just saying what I've been working on. Um, you, may, you may miss some stuff, but also uh, it's more for announcements, like, later on, so you don't miss those Kickstarters especially for this book when it finally comes out. So please go join and uh, subscribe um, to both those places. It helps out a lot. Um, also, I'm on Patreon. Uh, my patrons uh, are, um, you know, it's, it, it, they just give a little bit a month. Uh, it helps with the cost of everything, like just, you know, just keeping everything managed. Uh, and... Yes, they get early access uh, to announcements and also um, their names are on the credits uh, for this video. And thank you for those who are supporting me um, through, that, uh, through those means. Um, it helps out a great deal and I appreciate it a lot. Now, that's it. Uh, that's the video. Uh, I will talk to you all next week. Um, get in the back in the habit of uh, releasing these once a week. On Wednesday. I should I need to put that back in my banner of like when I release these. Um, but yeah, looking forward to it. Happy to be open about this stuff. Um, I know some of you are also creators and it's a lot of work. Uh, so yeah, have a great day. Bye.